Good evening, people. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, let's get it started tonight. Welcome one more time. And to take the first attendance. Okay, so please turn on your cameras and be ready <clears throat> to respond. Press and when I call your name, okay? Uh, it is time. Miguel Angel Dominguez. Present. Present. Hey, perfect. <laughs> Olga Marleni Gomez. Present teacher. Good. Welcome. Thank you. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. And Zenaida America Dominguez. And Hilda Xiomara Suriano. Present teacher. Hey, welcome. Ana Delmi Herrera. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Linda Stephanie Ramirez. Ana Marisol Mendoza. Nelson Iván Alfaro. 
day to night. Carla Veronica Surya. Ángel Alexander Guardado. Irma de Los Ángeles Flores. Present teacher. Hey, welcome. Yes, I can No, my mom has it. Ah, working, okay. Sorry, teacher. Okay. Mayra Roxana Hernandez. Present. Welcome. Carlos Alberto Melendez. Present. Good, welcome. Carolina Jamilet Hernandez. Present teacher. Good, welcome. Thank Silvia Suleyma Rodriguez. Present teacher. Perfect, welcome. Silvio Enrique Cortez. And Joanna Beatriz Orellana. Present teacher. Very good. Okay, perfect. Well, last class, last night, we were talking about how to use could be, would be, to talk about a probability or a possibility in the future, okay? Um, so, and in the conversation at the beginning of the lesson last night, uh, the idea is that we can use that form to talk about our um, contribution our possible contribution to a company, okay? When we are uh, applying for a new job and you want to let them know that you are um, someone who is going to help company, okay? Hablar de eso, podemos ayudar a la compañía podíamos ser en lo que podíamos hacer usamos esta forma would be could be ¿Ah? decía ahí en la conversación I would be a great asset the company okay I could be a great help in the, in the projects etc okay so, thinking about that, I want to share with you an article about the 10 more common questions in a job interview. 10 common questions in a job interview. Okay? Take a look to this. Um, okay. Here it is. Look at this article. Answers to 10 most common job interview questions. I'm going to share this link in WhatsApp with you. Okay, there you go. You have it in WhatsApp. Just let me read the first the, the, the questions. Okay, I'm going to read the questions. Question number one says, What are your weaknesses? ¿Cuáles son tus 
weaknesses. ¿Alguien sabe qué es weaknesses? ¿Nadie sabe? Weak. Weak. No. Un doble E. Vean acá. Weakness. Weak. Deficiencia. Deficiencias o debilidades. Eso es típico de cuestión en internet. No, no job internet. What are your weaknesses? What is all to The second question is, why should I hire you? Why should we hire you? Why should we hire you? ¿Te acuerdan que es hire? Contratado. Contratar. Ok. Contratar. Why should we hire you? ¿Qué te deberíamos? Contratar. Y ahí hay algo que explico. Vean, vean acá, por ejemplo, está el uso. I'm confident I would be a great addition to you. Yeah, ahí está el uso. Veamos. Number three. Why do you want to work here? Typical question. Okay. I need the money. Why do you want to work here? Or what are your goals? What are your goals? Ayer vimos. Ya recordamos que goals. Metas. Exactly. Number five. Why did you leave? Or why are you leaving your job? Another interesting question. Why did you leave your job? So your previous job. Why are you leaving your, your current job? Number six, when were you most satisfied in your job? When were you most satisfied? Seven. What can you do for us? that other candidates can. What can you do for us that other candidates can? Great. What are three positive things your last boss would say about you? What are three positive things your last boss would say about you. Number nine. Um, what salary are you seeking? How much money huh, do you want? What salary are you seeking? And number 10, if you were an animal, if you were an animal, which one would you want to be. If I were an animal, I would be a tiger. Why? I like tiger. Okay, but okay, so these are the 10 most common questions in a job interview. I will give you time to read the article just to get familiar with the answers. At least that possible. Tell them that. No les para tener una idea. Luego de que vean el artículo, lean un poco. No quiero que profundicen, solo lo lean un poco. I want you to respond these questions. I selected. Five questions. 
I select the five questions, okay? And I want you to respond these questions. As if you are uh, in a job interview. And I want you to use would be or could be in your answers, okay? For example, why do you want to work here? Uh, one of my possible, my possible answers. Uh, because I could be um, very helpful to others don't speak English. In my case, as, a, as an interpreter, why do you want to work here? Because I could be very helpful, yeah, I could be very helpful to others who don't speak English. Yo podría ser de mucha ayuda para otros que no hablan inglés. So, that's my case. Why should we hire you? Why should we hire you? Uh, because I would be very responsible and professional. For example, estas son mis respuestas. No se vale que copien estas. Okay, just to give you an idea. What can you do for us that other candidates can't? Incluso podemos usar can or can. Uh, um, I could be uh, what else can you do for us? Then I could be. Uh, great help to his company boss and allow him lo que hay que tener en esta entrevista. If you were an animal, which, uh, which one would you want to be? Okay. I would be a tiger. A R uh, A and independent. Me, that's me. And the last one. Why did you leave or why are you leaving your job? Because I am too 
My profession. Okay. Okay, these are my answers. These are my answers to this. Okay. I will send you the comment. Oh. Oh, I want to send you this image with my answer so you can have an idea to respond. And I will send you the chart, empty chart. So, el artículo que les he puesto ahí, el enlace para el artículo, es solo para informarse un poco. ¿Verdad? No van a trabajar nada de aquí. No es que me van a hacer un resumen del artículo ni que van a copiar del artículo. Solo para que se hagan una idea. ¿verdad? Cómo responder esta pregunta. Eh, si quieren lo pueden leer ya o lo pueden leer después. Pero lo que sí quiero es las cinco preguntas que he puesto ahí. Las respondan como en una entrevista. ¿Ok? Usando would be o could be lo más que pueda. ¿Ah? Lo más que pueda. Si sienten que no le hayan cómo usarlo en una particular respuesta. Pero como ven, y le puse ahí el ejemplo de mis respuestas, sí se puede usar. ¿verdad? Estamos hablando de lo que podríamos ser en la compañía. ¿Explico? ¿Es de Activity Clear? Yes, teacher. Ok, muy bien, muy bien. Como es, es individual, ¿verdad? No lo voy a colocar en grupo. ¿no? Voy a dar unos, unos diez minutos para que respondan. Y luego, colocar en grupo para que practiquen cuando uno está entrevistando al otro. ¿Ok? Eso vamos a ver. Any question? I will be here. Go ahead, work.
finish, please raise your hand. People, five minutes. Five minutes, please.
Okay, two more minutes. Okay, uh, con lo que tengan, verdad, uh, I'm going to send you to the breakout rooms and you're going to practice the interview, the job interview, with only these five questions, okay? So ask and answer, practice this interview. So please, Go to your groups and practice for a moment. Vayan a los grupos, por favor, con lo que tengan.
I'm going to ask you one question from this questionnaire, okay? And you give me your answer. Let's see, let me start with um, one volunteer. Any volunteer? Just to respond one question. Okay, Silvio, thank you. Uh, Silvio, why do you want to work here? Because your company is the better in the industry and I could be a great element in this company and I can I can develop my potential. Perfect, very good, very good. Excellent. Uh, now let's see. Um, Carla. Tell me, Carla, why should we hire you? Um, because I could be working and very responsible, responsible. I could be, okay, okay. Good. Let's see. Um, Marisol, what can you do yes. for us that other candidates cannot? Um, sorry. What can you Number do for three. us that okay. other candidate, candidates cannot? Okay, um, I could be very responsible and help you in your team. Um, okay, perfect, thank you. And mm -hmm. let's see, Joanna. Uh, yes, teacher. If you were an animal, which animal would you want to be? I like to be a cheetah because it's an animal to me, amazing and faster. Fast. Okay. Fast. Yeah. That means that you are a fast worker. Yes, teacher. <laughs> okay, very good. Um, let's see. Good. Caroline. Why did you leave or why are you leaving your job? Because it seemed to me that it will improve intellectually as well as economically. No sé ah. se also because I like dealing with children. Ah, okay, perfect, very good, thank you. Thank you. Now, let's see, Suleyma, I should not, the first one, why do you want to work here? Suleyma is frozen. Okay, let's go with Miguel. Sorry, Hi, Miguel. Tell me, why do you want to work here? In my, in my work here, Responder, uh, no me sirve. A biller. Teacher, me no tengo buena señal. Okay, and what happened with my headset? My headset is not working. Ah. Hola? Hello? Ah, okay. So, Miguel, I couldn't hear you. Uh, my word here, uh, a biller. 
Uh -huh. So why do you want to work here? I, I could be a best builder ah. in, my, in my work. Ah, okay, okay, good. Right. So, um, uh, let's see, Nelson. Yes. Why should we hire you, Nelson? Can you repeat, please? Sure, no problem. Why should we hire you? Uh, because I should be responsible and professional in my job. Ah, okay, okay. Very good, very good. Um, let's go back now to uh, Carlos. I am. <laughs> Are you ready now, Silvia? Yes, yeah. Okay. Let's see, Silvia. Okay, so uh what can you do for us that other candidates cannot do i could be an employee that help the company to achieve the goals vision and mission ah okay very good thank you okay now let's go back with carlos carlos if you were an animal which animal would you want to be I will be an elephant because they are brave, they have a good memory, and a working team. Ah, okay, yes, right. Uh, now, let's see, Hilda. Yes, teacher, I'm here. Okay, why did you leave, or why are you leaving your job? Ah, because I would like a job that gives me more opportunity to improve. Ah, okay. Very good. Excellent. Uh, let's see. Myra. Yes, teacher. Okay, Myra. Um, Let's go to the first one again. Why do you want to work here? I want to work here because I like the philosophy. Philosophy? philosophy? I don't philosophy. The company. Uh -huh. Philosophy, the company, and I could contribute a new idea for the project's company. Ah, okay, very good, very good. Uh, let's see, Olga. Why should we hire you? Because I would be a good choice to your team and I could make the positive difference. Ah, okay, perfect. Now, who's missing here? Claudia is just listening. She's not making issues. Girl, Simana, Nelson, Pedro. Okay, everyone is done. Perfect, very good, very good. Good answers, okay. And most of you use, could be and would be in a, great. Okay. Now I'm going to take the second attendance and then we are going to continue with the next lesson. Please respond present. Miguel Angel Dominguez. Present, present. Okay, thank you. Olga Marlene Gomez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. Present, teacher. Good. Tenaida, okay, Claudia, um, just to tell you that the personal session is with you tonight, okay? Okay, teacher. Perfect. Uh, Zenaida America Dominguez didn't show up today. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. 
present teacher. Perfect. Ana Delmi Herrera. I was here. Not anymore. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Didn't show up today. Linda Stephanie Ramirez. Mm -mm. Ana Marisol Mendoza. Present. Okay. Nelson Ivan Alfaro. Present. Good. Carla Verónica Suria. Present. Good. Ángel Alexander Guardado. Ángel, please respond. Irma de Los Ángeles Flores. Present teacher. Okay. Mayra Roxana Hernández. Present teacher. Good. Carlos Alberto Meléndez. Present. Good. Um, Carolina Jamilet Hernández. Present teacher. Good. Silvia Zuleima Rodríguez. Present teacher. Good. Silvio Enrique Cortez. Present. Good. And Joanna Beatriz Orellana. Present teacher. Perfect. Okay. Let's continue now. Okay, you have this um, objective now for this lesson. The end of this lesson, you will be able to talk about your work experience. Ah, that's it. Talk about your work experience. Okay. Uh, one question, how long have you worked in your company? How long have you worked in your company so far, hasta ahora? How long have you worked in your company? Uh, for example, Marisol, how long have you worked in the hotel? I have worked for four years. Four years, okay. Um, what about you, Nelson? How long have you worked in your company? I have three years in, in my company. Three, three years, okay. And Caroline, how long have you worked in your company? Perdón, teacher. How long have you worked ah, okay. in your company? Uh, I have a 20, 20 years. Wow. 20 years. 20 years. Yes. Ah. Hi, Angel. You want to participate? I see your hand raised. Hello, teacher. <laughs> Hi. Hello. It's a problem in the man in the video. Sorry. Ah, okay, okay, okay. No problem. Um, what about uh, uh Xiomara? How long have you worked in your company? I work for three years. Three years, okay. And let's see, Myra, what about you? How long have you worked in your company? I work for 70 years. 70? Seven, Seven zero? Se no, 17. 17, ah, yeah. wow, a lot as well. Yeah. 17 years. Okay, so a lot. Very good. Okay, and the other question is 
Have you occupied different positions? Have you occupied different positions in your company? Oh, let me ask to Carlos. Have you occupied different positions in your company, Carlos? Yes, two positions. Um, first, um, a countable and actually in sports. Ah, okay, good. And what about you, Silvio? Have you occupied different positions in your company? Yes, I, I, I have uh, 10 years and changed the, the position for many, many times. Many times. In the, in the two areas. In the two different areas. Areas, contability, oh. in contability, many positions, and supports ah, okay. of the systems. Ah, okay. okay. Um, what about uh, Olga? Have you occupied different positions in your company? Microphone, Olga, we cannot hear you. Ah, uh, sorry. In my company, and I, I, I was comfortable and then I was auxiliar the auditory inventory. Okay. Okay. Yes. okay. Good. And um, what about, uh, well, Myra? Myra has 17 years in the company. How many positions have you occupied in your company, Myra? in 17 years. Um, yeah, I start with a seller. Uh -huh. and, and then I occupied the gift of audit. audit. Um, after that, I occupied with analyze the accountable for the Costa Rica. Mm. Um, um, so I don't, I don't, how do you say subcontador? Subaccountant, maybe? Okay, and, and after I saw a content for the company, and today I am accountable. Oh, okay, very good. And I'm curious about Caroline, in 20 years, how many positions have you occupied in your company? 20 years. Caroline? Hello. How um, many positions have you occupied in your company? Um, eh, ay, es, how many? Eh, One, two, three many? positions. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, uh, I have a, um, a reception, a, two despachos, como se dice? Despacho, what do you mean with despacho? Grupo o despacho de despachar? No, no, no. Eh, dos despachos o más bien dos clínicas. Ah, okay. Do, uh -huh. Offices. Uh, two, 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 two office. Two office. Uh -huh. Two office. Um, uh, in Dr. Castro. Uh, and Doctora de Castro. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, uh, los, los consultorios, uh, se les llaman offices también. Um, the doctor. Es la historia del doctor. Así, así los llaman. Clinic es, es, okay. es algo que está un poco más amplio. Áreas. Áreas. Ok. Very good. Very good. So, interesting. Now, let's take a look to the conversation we have here. Let me share the screen again. We're going to practice this conversation. 
Okay, listen, I'm going to read it first and then we're going to practice. Okay, let me record the conversation in of WhatsApp. Oh, you. Tell me about your work experience. I worked at Unilever for five years. Actually, I worked in this company from 2011 to 2016. I quit because I was offered a new job in Panama. And what happened there? It was just for a short period of time. It was just for eight months until my project was done. Then I came back to El Salvador. And you have not worked since you came back? Not really. I have done some independent jobs, you know, but they have not been for long. Okay, there you go. One more time, please. Tell me about your experience. I worked at Unilever for five years. Actually, I worked in this company from 2011 to 2016. I quit because I was offered a new job in Panama. What happened there? It was just for a short period of time. It was just for eight months until my project was done. Then I came back to El Salvador. You have not worked since you came back? Not really. I have done some independent jobs, you know, but they have not been for long. Okay. Now let's practice. Okay, please listen and repeat after me. Tell me about your work experience. Tell me about your work Tell me about your work experience. I worked at Unilever for five years. Actually, I worked in this company from 2011 to 2016. With because I was offered a new job in Panama. I worked at uh, for, for, for five years. Actually, I worked in this company from 2011 to 2016. I quit because I was a new job in Panama. And what happened there? What happened? Uh, it was just yeah, for a short What happened there? What happened there? <laughs> it was just for a short period of time. It was just for eight months until my project was done. Then I came back to El Salvador. It was just for, was a, just for, for a short, short period, period of, of time. time. I it was, was for just eight for eight, eight months. months. Until my Until project, project was done. Then I, I come back, back to El Salvador. And you have not worked since you came back? And you have, you not, have worked not worked since you come back? Not really. I have done some independent jobs, you know, but they have not been for long. Not really. Not really. I have I done have some done independent, independent jobs, you know, independent. You know no. but they, they have, have not been for long. But they have not been for long. Okay, very good. Now, I am Julio and you are Anna. Okay? Well, I begin. Okay. Tell me about your work experience. I worked at Unilever for five years. Actually, I worked for this company from 2011 to 
And what happened there? It was just a short video time. It was just for eight months until my house was done. Then I come back to El Salvador. You have not worked since you came back? No, really. No, really. I have yeah. done some yeah. in the job. Yeah. No, no. No. But they, no. Have, no. But they yeah. have not yeah. before yeah. Long. long. Okay, very good. Now you are Julio and I am Anna. Okay, you begin. One, two, three. Tell me about, me about your work, work experience. experience. I worked at Unilever for five years. Actually, I worked in this company from 2011 to 2016. I quit because I was offered a new job in Panama. In what and what happened, happened there? there? And what happened in there? It was just for a short period of time. It was just for eight months until my project was done. Then I came back to El Salvador. And you have and you not have worked at St. Jupan and come back? Come back. Not really. I have done some independent jobs, you know, but they have not been for long. Okay, very good. Um, any question with this conversation? Just quickly a review of some words. This word, worked, worked. Words. Remember I told you that this, esta terminación, this ending, ed, nunca se pronuncia ed. ¿Verdad? No decimos worked. ¿No? Teacher. Hola. Uh, pronunciation the uh, those years the years Hello, vamos a ver. ya voy entonces esta en este caso es work 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 ya work a ver me preguntan por los años usualmente los años se dan en número de dos en dos ¿verdad? Entonces, este año se puede decir 2011 to 2016. ¿Eh? O también 2011 to 2016. Pero lo más común es 2011 2016. For example, this year is 2021. We are in 2021. Okay, hay lo más. Bien. Actually, what is the meaning of actually? No lo confundamos con una palabra en español muy parecida. De hecho. Actually, yes, the H. The H. And, you know where, let's start. Quit. Quit. No, you quit a job. You quit a habit. Okay. I quit smoking. Okay, I quit smoking. Quit. So I stop. So quit. Renunciar. Dejar de hacer algo. Dejar con algo. Quit. Um, 
Esta otra, parecido, no, lo que decíamos, no, es what happened. No, este ed no nunca se pronuncia así. En este caso es what happened. What happened. Ok. Uh, I came. Es the past form and the past part no. Es el past part. Es came. Es el pasado. I came back. Luego acá tenemos word. Uh, independent job. Ok. Nada más por mencionar algunas para la hora que practiquen. Ok, so I will send you to working pairs to practice the conversation and to respond these three questions. Conversation. Number one, when did Anna start working in Unilever? When did she stop working there? Or two questions in one. Why did she quit her job in Unilever? And this is a personal question. Have you ever done independent jobs? Okay, so three questions about the conversation and one personal question. All right. So let me form the groups again. You could practice, you can practice. Teacher. Hola. Eh, Nos puede dar acceso a poder compartir una pantalla cuando estemos en el background. Uh, pues deberían de. Eh, me parece que solo el anfitrión puede compartir. Uh, one participant who can share all participants. Yeah, I think it's okay. Yes, it is. Yeah. Okay. 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 Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Bien. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's Bueno, espero que... Espero que nadie que... O están. Ok, go. Practice the conversation and respond the questions. See you in... Uh, ten.
Quarantine. Me escuchan. Sí, sí, ah, oímos. No las oigo. Nosotros oh, sí. Me no, escucha. No. Ok, hoy sí, hoy sí, hoy sí. Ah, bye. Ok. Actuality me dijeron. No, currently. Oh, just. Just. It was just for, for a short period, period of time. Period. 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 <laughs> Period, no, period, no, period. Pero ella me entendió. <laughs> period of time. It was just for eight months. Okay, now are you fully? Tell me about your work experience. I work at Unilever for five years. Actually, I worked in this company from 2011 to 2016. I quit because I was offered my staff. Finish the shirt. Okay, very good. Okay. Enter. 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 Así como como él dice pero es until 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 until. Y este es actually. Si gusta cambiamos y probamos este. Bye. Sí. Bye. Comienza usted. Eh. Tell me about your work experience. <laughs> okay, entonces. Yo eh, le dejaría así. ¿Cómo? Yo le dejaría en el 3 así. I have a contract with the company and I have a work independent. Ajá. Uh -huh. Un trabajo independiente. Ok. Ajá. Mm -hmm. Ok, si gusta practiquemos una vez más eh, mientras nos llama. Vaya, empieza así. La pronunciación. ¿Cuál le gusta pronunciar?
Okay, welcome back. I'd like to hear some of you. Okay, let's see. Please, group number two, Claudia and Silvio, please. You share the conversation. Okay. Okay, Silvio. Okay. Okay. Is that for Yes. You first. You first. Ah, okay, good. Okay, yeah. Uh, tell me about your work experience. I worked at the Unilever for five years, actually. I worked in this company from 2011 to 2016. I quit because I was offered a new job in Panama. And what happened, Till? I was just for a short period of time. I was just for eight months until my project was done. Then I came back to El Salvador. And you have not worked since you come back? Not really. I have done some independent job, you know, but they have not been for long. Okay, thank you. Okay. Now, please, Miguel Angel and Suleyma. Okay. Um, in this year, Miguel. Uh, solo que no se puede compartir dicha la, okay. la conversación, please. Sure. Okay. okay, thank you. Tell me about your world experience. I worked on Unilever for five years. Actually, I worked in the company from 2011 and 2016. I quit because I was offered a new job in Panama. And what happened there? It was just for a short period of time. I was just for eight months until my project was done. Then I come back to El Salvador. And you have not worked since you came back? No, really. I don't, I have done some independent jobs, you know, but they have not been for long. Okay, very good. Thank you. Now, uh, please, um, Angel and Xiomara. Okay. I'm here, teacher. Great. Okay, yeah. Xiomara. Okay. Tell me, how are you work experience? I worked at Unilever for five years. Actually, I worked in I worked in this company from 2011 to 2016. I quit because I was offered a new job in Panama. And what happens there? It was just for a short period of time. It was just for eight months until my project was done. Then I came back to El Salvador. And you have not worked since you came back? Not really. I have done some independent jobs, you know, but they have not been for long. Okay, very good, very good. Okay. Uh, 
let us just let's take some work. Um, for example, um, this. Okay, uh, reset here. Okay. Came, came back, came back. Okay, careful. Muchos me lo pronunciaron con. Pasado es came. Okay, came back. And the other is this. No es signs, I mean, es since, since, okay, also this one. Um, the stress for this is here, independent. Independent. Okay, have done some independent jobs. Be careful with that. Independent. Um, yeah, basically. And well, maybe this one. Uh, no, es, no es just ni just. Es como un just. Just. Okay. La U es un. Oh. Just. Okay. Any question with the conversation? No. So let's continue then. With these time expressions, these time expressions, okay? Ya lo habíamos mencionado esto en el pasado, algunas de estas. For, we use for plus period of time, so. I work in Diana for seven years. For seven years. Okay. Since specific point in the past. Lo mencionamos anteriormente cuando hablamos del present perfect. I have worked there since 2005 or 2005. Este, cuando hablamos cuando una, la fecha en que una actividad comenzó en el pasado. Then from. Usamos from to, ¿verdad? From to, para hablar de cuando comenzó una actividad. Cuando terminó. I stay there from January to November. De enero a. Then, then to introduce a new event in a series. Esto lo vimos cuando hablábamos de las diferentes palabras para describir un proceso. De las palabras para describir un, un proceso. So then, o oh, entonces, ¿verdad? Uh, puede traducir. I work in that company until 2011. Then, bit. Trabajé en esa compañía hasta el 2011. Entonces, y until, mark the end of an activity or a period of time. 
para, para mencionar. ¿okay? El final de la actividad o el periodo de tiempo. I work in Panama until my project was over. Hasta. Right? Ok. So, son expresiones de tiempo. Any question with these expressions? If not, let's finish with this exercise to complete the, this text of Nicole's work experience. Okay, you have to fill in the blanks with the words for, seen, from, from, to, no. A ver, lo leo y me dice que debemos ir poniendo. Nicole was born in San Salvador, El Salvador, in 1985. She graduated from UCA University. She studied there. Debería ir acá. From. 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 2005. Two. Uh, two. 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 Usualmente los años del 2000 hasta el 2009, más común en este caso, a ver, la forma más común, 2001, 2002, 2003, 2006, 2009. ¿Ah? Incluso hasta el 2010. 10. Bueno, es lo que yo he escuchado que más. Aunque decir 2005, 2001, 2002. Ok. Luego. Uh, then. Then. And then, then she worked in Molsa mm, seven four, years. Four. Four. Echo for seven years. For seven years. So. Then. Mm, no. Mm, she was a child. She wanted to be a manager of a great and important company. Science. Ajá, la pronunciación correcta. Y... Sing. Ajá. Sing. Sing. Muy bien. Since she was a child, she wanted to be a manager of a great and important company. She did not have to wait much to make this dream come true. Because the man who was the manager, huh? Until? Mm. Hello. Come on. Four. Four. Well, manager for almost 15 years. His name was Gonzalo and he worked there. Huh? Sing. Uh, Hoy hasta 2015. ¿Cuál es hasta? Antes. Antes. 
Today, Nicole is a successful person. She works. Mm -hmm. Until. Mm -hmm. Monday, mm, Saturday. From? 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 Sí. From? Monday. Two. 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 Monday to Saturday. And she loves her job. He has not worked there. Una nos falta que no le hemos dado. Long. He has not worked there long, but her team supports her. Ella no ha trabajado ahí mucho tiempo, but her team supports her. Okay. Ahora. De mañana presentarían ustedes un párrafo similar a este. About your work experience. Me escucho cortado. Hola, me voy cortado. Me escucha cortado. Creo que es la Inter, está inestable. Así he estado yo, pero... Entonces, les decía que eh, tomorrow you're going to present your work experience. So, if you have time, prepare some notes about your work experience. Similar to Nicole's. No solo quiero que le vayan quitando y cambiando fechas nombres a ese de Nicole. No, 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 no. Vamos a fusilar ese. Venga, sí, déjeme ver su work experience. Es una idea. ¿Verdad? Uh -huh. Ok, no solo, ah, aquí en vez de 2011 le pongo el año. En base ah, a ese nada, vamos nada. a hacer el nuestro. ¿Verdad? Pero no solo de, de cortar y pegar. Uh -huh. No. Usa sus de propias, usen sus propias palabras. Ok, to talk about your work experience. Ok. And um, voy a darles tiempo para que lo terminen. Yo sé que algunos no tienen tiempo en el trabajo. Y luego de que lo terminen, lo presentan. Tienen chance de hacer una presentación. Sí, está perfecto. No solo cuentan su. ¿Ok? Okay, people, let's take the last attendance tonight. Any question about the activity for tomorrow? No. Perfect. No, teacher. And remember, you have to use these words, okay? This time expression, for, since, until, okay, long, from, to, Okay, let's see. Miguel Angel. No, vamos a empezar de abajo. Okay, Joana Beatriz Orellana. Present teacher. Okay, very good. You see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Silvio Enrique Cortez. Present. Okay, Silvio, thank you for attending. See you tomorrow. Bye. Silvia Suleima Rodriguez. Silvia Suleima. Present teacher. Ah, okay. Present teacher. Okay, good Present night, teacher. Silvia. Yes, 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 I got it. Thank you. Um, Carolina Jamilet Hernandez. Present teacher. Okay, see you tomorrow. See Good you night. tomorrow. Good night.
Carlos Alberto Meléndez. Present. Okay. See you tomorrow, Carlos. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Mayra Roxana Hernández. Mayra Present Roxana. Teacher. Okay, Mayra. Oh, good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. See you. Irma de Los Ángeles Flores. Irma, ya se no fue. Ángel Alexander Guardado. Present teacher. Ok, see you tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow. Carla Verónica Zuria. Carla Verónica. Present teacher. Ok, Carla. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Nelson Ivan Alfaro. Present teacher. Okay, Nelson. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. See you. Ana Marisol Mendoza. Present. Okay, Ana Marisol. See you tomorrow. Okay, good see night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Stephanie didn't show up. Alejandra Mesa didn't show up. Tell me neither. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Present teacher. Okay. Good night, Xiomara. Good night, teacher. See you tomorrow. Ida didn't show up. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. Present teacher. Okay, Claudia. Please don't go. See you in a moment. Yes, teacher. Olga Marleni Gomez. Present teacher. Okay, Olga. A good night. See you tomorrow. Okay. Thank you. Have a nice time. You too. And Miguel Angel Dominguez. Present teacher. Good okay. Night. Good night. See you. Okay. Okay, Claudia, how are you? Hi, teacher. Uh, teacher, um, I have a problem in the sentences uh, yesterday. Huh? And, and todo en el orden. O sea, me confunde porque yo la había estado haciendo, pero Siempre con la idea que primero como que va el, el sujeto, ¿verdad? Pero ya cuando las hago, pues no, no es así siempre la forma en que, en que se estructura. Entonces ahí me confunde porque las de ayer sí me costaron. O sea, no. Sí, es que esto no... No hay, como que le dijera un orden estricto, porque depende de lo que estemos hablando, eso es lo que tenemos que buscarle el sentido a la frase de lo que estamos hablando. ¿Verdad? Utilizamos eh, el ejercicio de ayer. Eh, por ejemplo, que dice que el número, creo que es la una que era bien larga, la número cuatro creo que es que incluso salen los ejercicios verdad de que está en, el, en la plataforma Ajá. esa no no me sale bien o sea yo la estaba haciendo porque ayer estuvimos trabajando en esa pero, y la hice pero ahorita que yo la pongo en la plataforma no sé si algo yo le estoy poniendo mal que no me la me la pone mal la cuatro sí vamos a ver es que la cuatro tenía un problema en la plataforma yo lo reporté y me dijeron que ya lo había elegido. Ah, bueno, yo la tenía, quiero ver cómo la tenía. La cuatro. La cuatro. Sí, ese que dice. La tenía yo. We can also work be a good option to have a happy, a happy stuff. So would be. We can of 
will be. Uh -huh. uh, a good option to have a happy staff. Sí. No sé si algo. We can solve to be a good option to have a No sé si la intentaba hacer ahora. No, no, ahora ya no. Lo voy a intentar, lo intenté ayer. Entonces, aquí cuando <risa> yo la voy a. Un poco la aceptó. No, pues quizá esta. Todavía la han dejado mal. La han dejado mal porque si usted ve la respuesta que han programado es esta. ¿Eh? Weekends off would be a good option to have to a have happy stuff. Le han puesto el A en la posición incorrecta. Oh, ah. Have, um, pero está to have a happy, ah, a happy. Exacto. To have a happy stuff. Happy stuff. Yeah. Como lo hemos hecho, como lo hicimos, es lo correcto. Ya lo voy a volver a reportar porque. Está mal. Le corrigieron unas cosas, pero le dejaron otro error. Ok, entonces esperamos, ¿verdad? Teacher. Mm -hmm. Bueno, entonces ahí realmente, pero puede ser de que la respuesta, puede haber más de una respuesta en ese caso, digamos de la oración, o, o, o es que pues, si yo la comprendo diferente y la estructuro, no sé. No me salga la bien. verdad que sí, hay algunas que la misma, el, la misma idea se puede expresar en diferente orden. ¿Verdad? Por ejemplo. Veamos cómo pudiéramos. Veamos esta, esta misma. A good option to have a happy staff would be una buena opción en dar al personal. Una buena opción para tener un personal feliz. ¿Qué día? Weekend. Día. Fines de semana libres. Fines o sea, de semana. Uh -huh. Por eso lo que tiene que usted ver es que si la idea no está bien planteada, ¿verdad? Más que decir, este es el único orden que hay. Sí. Ahora sí. bien, en, en la plataforma le ponen una respuesta, nada más. Ajá, sí, que esa es, solo eso tengo que hacer. O sea, tengo que buscarle la forma que me la dé correcta. Exacto. Ok. Bueno. Pero hay muchas cosas en que podemos eh, eh, cambiar el orden y mantener la misma. Ah, ok, está bien. Eh, y ahorita solo una pregunta más con la clase de ahora. 
en la que es esta palabra, el uso de things, dijo usted la palabra things, es verdad. Things. Uh -huh. things. Sí. ¿En, ¿En qué específicamente es que vamos a ocupar esa parte? Es que esa me da duda, things. Ok, things es cuando usted menciona el tiempo en que una actividad comenzó en el pasado. En el, pa ah, en el pasado. Uh -huh. Es el, el desde. Yo vivo, I live in Lourdes since 2001. Juan. Okay. Vivo en Lourdes desde. O, eh, y no, se, no necesariamente tiene que ser una fecha, puede ser un evento. Por ejemplo, uh, I live in Lourdes since I got married. Rico, vivo en Lourdes desde que me casé. Pero no necesariamente a... una fecha. Sí, no necesariamente una fecha. ¿Verdad? Me explico. Pero ah, sí es... Pero sí pero estoy si definiendo algo. Tiempo. Ah, exacto, estamos hablando de tiempo. Ah, okay. Desde cuándo una actividad comenzó. ¿Ah? Okay. Y ah, es... Yo trabajo ah. en esta compañía desde que me mudé a Estados Unidos. Uh -huh. Estoy hablando de el, cuando una actividad comenzó en el pasado. Ahorita, ¿cuándo? Es el, el desde. Y el until, until. Ok, el until es hasta. Ah, es hasta. Este, hasta. Ok. Okay, cuando cuando termino una actividad. Ah, hoy sí, ya me quedó claro. Está bien, teacher. Okay. Agradezco su tiempo. Bueno, para servirle. Entonces. Bueno. Sí. Have a good See night you. then, Claudia. Good night, teacher. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you. Take care.